Okay, hi everyone, my name is Teresa Coulter and I'm a life coach and I specialize helping people learn how to manage their inner critics. And today's topic is around dealing with difficult people. Kramer! <laughs> Hello, Newman. Um, and the biggest thing I want to tell you out of this whole thing, I'll tell you it right up front in the beginning, is whatever you do, don't react. If you are dealing with a very difficult person or a difficult situation, Whatever you do, don't react to it. There's so much power behind not reacting to the difficult person or the situation, um, and that's actually how we keep our power in this situation. Um, my coaching program, they always say, everything people do and say is about them, and how we respond to it is about us. Um, so if you are dealing with a difficult person and your buttons are being pushed, and you're just like, oh my God, I can't take this person any longer, that's when you pause, you stop, you take a breath and walk away or do whatever you can to not react. If you react to the person, to what they're saying, you are actually activating the cycle of the argument that's going to happen and it's gonna keep replaying and replaying. Um, also, if you are dealing some um, in a relationship that you might have, uh, every time you react with the person and you guys get engaged into the argument and it's probably the same argument over and over and it's this repetitive cycle, it's because someone is reacting. Someone can initiate the conflict and then they need somebody to actually meet them and react to the conflict to activate the cycle. But if you don't react, you don't activate the cycle, so therefore it just shuts down the whole process altogether. Um, so not reacting actually will shut down the cycle of the argument or chain of events that is about to happen. Um, and so that's actually where you keep all of your power because the other person, whatever they're doing and saying, if you don't react to it, it doesn't give them power. It doesn't give them the opportunity to carry on and drag out the drama or whatever it is they're trying to do. It just shuts it down. Um, so the biggest thing you can do is not react and just walk away. Um, and a lot of times you just, you wanna react, you wanna yell, you wanna scream. Um, and we always wanna have the last word. It always feels good to be right. Like you always just wanna be right in a situation. Um, but that's actually not what we're supposed to do. The best thing we can do for both people involved is to not react and just walk away. And this can be difficult if you are someone who's used to arguing and fighting, um, but you'll actually find some peace in your life um, if you learn to embrace this power of just not reacting and walking away. Um, it actually will kind of die down all the drama in your life and it will just continue all the negative cycles that, might you, that you might have with other people in other situations. <sighs> What a wonderful day. And I actually like to make a game out of it. I always say to my clients, it's a game called not react. Whatever you do, don't react. Like the other person wants you to react because they want to get the rise out of you. They want to get the drama, especially if it's someone who's really good at manipulating and really knows that they can push your buttons. Um, they want they want to get that out of you. So to be powerful and to um, not allow them to get away with that, you, you stay in your power by not reacting to what they want. They want you to react. Whatever the situation is, they're trying to drag you into, they're trying to drag you to their level. Um, but you have all the power by not reacting and staying true to yourself. That's my little tidbit about not reacting. Take it with you and take it with every difficult person you have to deal with, every difficult situation. When you're right in the urge of reacting and about ready to explode, just pause yourself, take a breath, and just do whatever you can to remove or not react to the person or the situation. Don't worry, I have your back with this process. If you want help learning how not to react, contact me for a free session. We'll go through the steps together um, and you will be amazing and you won't have any more drama and co conflict in your life. It's amazing, it's so freeing to not react and be able to walk away. Um, that's actually how you win the situation. That's actually how you have the last word is by not responding. Um, so good luck with the game. I know you can do it. Play the game of do not react and see what changes in your life. Um, be sure to subscribe, click the little red button to subscribe to learn more about other videos that I have. Um, you can follow me on Instagram, let go live, also on Facebook, and go to my website, let go live coaching to get your free coaching session. Um, so I love you, you're amazing. Um, stay in your power, don't react. Whatever you do, don't react. I know you can do it.